Hello guys, my name is Glenn, my name is Daryl. Welcome to our show where we will discuss about the multiple intelligences. For our topic today, now I have to tell you guys the history of the multiple intelligences. So the theory of multiple intelligences was developed in 1983 by Dr. Howard Gardner, professor of education at Harvard University. It suggests that the traditional notion of intelligence based on IQ testing is far too limited. Instead, Dr. Gardner proposes eight different intelligences to account for a broader range of human potential in children and adults. These intelligences are Linguistic intelligence, logical mathematical intelligence, spatial intelligence, bodily kinesthetic intelligence, musical intelligence, interpersonal intelligence, intrapersonal intelligence, and natural intelligence. Dr. Gardner says that our school and culture focus most on of their attention on linguistic and logical mathematical intelligence. We esteem the highly articulate or logical people on our on our culture. However, Dr. Gardner says that we could also place equal attention on individuals who show gifts in a, the other intelligences, the artists, architects, musicians, naturalists, designers, dancers, therapists, entrepreneurs, and others who enrich the world in which we live. The theory of multiple intelligences proposes a major transformation in our way of our school around. It suggests the teachers be trained to present their lesson in a wide variety of ways using music, cooperating learning, art activities, role play, multimedia field trips, inner reflection, and much more. The good news is that the theory of multiple intelligence has grabbed many attention of the educators around the country, and hundreds of schools are using it as a philosophy to redesign the way it educates children. The bad news is that we are there there are thousands of schools still out there that teach in the same old dull way through the dry lectures and boring worksheet and textbooks the challenge is to get this information out to many more teachers school and administrators and others who work with children so that each child has the opportunity to learn in ways harmonious with their unique minds So this is our survey result that we got from doing a short survey to our classmates and this is my personal survey result and I am an interpersonal person. And this is my survey and I am a kinesthetic and interpersonal person. Thank you. After doing the first survey, we take another survey to know how our classmates study in their own ways and we found out many unique answers from all of them. Hello guys, today I'm with Jason to ask a couple of questions. So hi Jason. Hi. Uh, do you prefer studying with music or quietly to concentrate? With music. Why? Because it is relaxing. Okay. How can listening to songs make you better at studying? Because my brain works with it. Okay. And what kind of genre of music do you like to listen while studying? Mostly Why? pop because it is relaxing. Okay. What mu musical instrument can you play? Mm, piano. And it helps you to study better? I think yes. Okay. Tell me, what are the best benefits of listening to music, especially when you're in the studying process? Then you can memorize better with music. Okay. Thank you. Hello guys, today I'm with Jason to ask a couple of questions. So, hi Jason. Yeah, hi. Do you prefer studying with music or quietly to concentrate? Uh, I prefer listening with music. Okay. And why do you really enjoy to listening to music while studying? Because it helps me get relaxed and keeps me concentrated. Okay. And how can listening to songs make you better at studying? Because everything that I study when I'm listening to music can go easily to my brain so oh, I yeah, can yeah, nice easily. What kind of genre of music that you like to listen while you're studying? I like the classical music, it's very relaxing and also it's not that long. Oh, okay. 
And what kind of musical instrument that you can play? Oh, uh, I can play violin and I can play piano. And does it help you to study and be more smart and study easier? Well, sometimes it Sometimes piano use reflexes and reflexes are very important at some sports. And tell me, what are the benefits that you get from listening to music, especially for your studying process? Well, the benefit I can get great grades because I got very, very intelligent when I study. Okay. Hello, now I'm with Kathleen. I will ask some questions. Do you prefer studying with music or quietly to concentrate? Well, I prefer to listening to music when I'm studying because I like to listen to music. Why do you really enjoy listening music while studying? Because it makes me focus when I'm studying. How can listening? The song makes you better at studying. It helped me to concentrate when I'm studying. What kind of genre of music that you like to listen while studying and what? The slow one. What musical instrument can you play? If not, what kind of musical instrument do you wish to learn to make your more relaxed? Tell me, what are the benefits that you get from listening to music, especially for your studying process? It helped me to relax and concentrate when I'm studying. Hello, now I'm going to explain about the story of National Exam. 1965 until 1972, ujian pengabdian nasional made a name change to ujian negara, but followed by change in delivery system. In the new era, a matter already nationally. 1972 until 1979, the ex state exam was abolished. Abolition of national equality test and critics and education expert in the, the education world experiencing adversity children who do not pass the exam schools considered commonplace in the schools when in determining the criteria for graduation as a result the quality and education the world of education tried to get a period of the 1980s was born the Eptana and the Eptanas as a result of learning the final stage which is carried at the national level. At this time, both values are combined and generate value determined of graduation. Aptanas changed its name to Ujian National Final. In the period from 2001 to 2004 and then changed again to the national examination since 2005. Since that time, the, ex the national exam and school exam combined. The result become a value th that determines Graduation national systems unchanged in 2015. Nation, national exam scores are not the main indicator. Determines the students' graduation value and only for their competent students. Determination for of graduation return to the school. The school which determine a student pass or not pass. What was your preparation like? I prepare everything as well as I could by study two weeks before UNAS and prepare the subjects material for UNAS. How did you feel during the test? I was surprised before the test started, but during the test I didn't feel anything. 
what was the result? I was satisfied with the result because I passed the exam well. What are your suggestions for your juniors for the upcoming computer-based national exam? My suggestion for you guys are you have to study harder and prepare it two or three weeks before the next. What was your preparation like? My preparation for national exams is just study harder and pray to God. How did you feel during the test? At first, I feel nervous, but during the test, I thought the test is not as hard as I think. What was the result? The result is as good as I hope. What are your suggestions for your juniors for the upcoming computer-based national exam? For the junior, you must study and pray to God. Now I'm going to tell you guys about some tips for the musical learners. First, you can create songs and rhythms about subjects you're learning. You can also use the moods of different types of music to help you study different topics. Third, make up sounds that you can attach to items of knowledge for better recall. You can create songs and rhythms about subjects you are learning. You can also use music to help you reduce stress. Finally, use music topics in your studies. For example, if you are studying a different culture, ask if you can write an essay about its music. Thank you guys for listening our information about multiple intelligence. Especially about the musical learner. We hope you can learn better as a musical learner. Thank you.